We're making our way home from our huge summer adventure. It's actually kind of sad. Yeah, the summer is coming to an end. However, on our way home, we're going to try to hit a couple of states that we haven't been to before. Oh. So, if you're like us, you have something that you are coloring in or putting a sticker on or something. We have a pillow that we use. Uh, and our rules to color this in is that we have to stay overnight and do something in that state. And there are two separate states that we're going to hit in order to color in the map on our pillow. Yep, uh, the plan is uh, we stayed in South Dakota last night and we're heading to Sioux Falls, which we've heard is very pretty falls in the downtown area of Sioux Falls. Mm -hmm. So we're going to show you a little bit of that. And then we'll head down to the surf ballroom in Iowa and it's I believe Clear Lake uh, Iowa I'll double check that one and if you're a music fan and heard the song by Don McLean America Pie you might recognize the surf ballroom uh, and we'll tell you a little bit more about that so stay tuned for that as we get there let's go gotta pack up <laughs> first thing on the list get this RV ready to roll let's roll Okay, so y'all have all heard of Buddy Holly. We are at the Surf Ballroom. One of our viewers told us about this and it was just too much on our route for us not to go a little bit out of our way and come and see it. This is the last place that he played before Buddy Holly and... Uh, Richie Valley and the Big Bopper. Were all killed in the tragic plane wreck. They yeah. were killed just about six miles from here. Their plane went down because yeah. they were trying to get to their next uh, concert that they had to do. So we're going to go in and check this out. They say it's really super cool. Now, Buddy Holly and those guys were killed before we were born, so you might not know who they are. So look them up. And you probably have heard the song Bye Bye Miss American Pie. If you haven't heard it, you've been living in a cave. And uh, <laughs> that's the song about this. Uh, plane wreck that Don McLean sang that was so popular that still everybody yeah, knows. So. Everybody knows American Pie. So it's a, that's what the, the song is about, this tragic event. So let's go check out the museum. I'm yep. excited. Yep. To the levee, but the levee was dry. Them good old boys are drinking whiskey and rye. Singing this will be the day that I die. This will be the day that I die Did you write the book of love? Do you have faith in God above? And if the Bible tells you so 
also they still have concerts here at the Surf Ballroom. Uh, you might recognize some of the names. Uh, also on the other poster is uh, Three Dog Night, so a lot of you remember them. So uh, it's here if you if you want to come check out some of the music. Oh, that you're in love with him, cause I saw you dancing in the gym. You both kick off your shoes. Man, I dig those rhythm and blues. I was a lonely teenager, a rocking buck with a pink carnation and a pickup truck. But I knew that I was out of luck the day the music died. We started singing so bye bye, Miss American Pie. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. Them good old boys are drinking whiskey and rice. Singing... So, this is the room where all the artists hung out before they went up on the stage to play, and I'm going to walk up there in a minute. But it has become a tradition. They're still performing in this hall all the way to today, and it has become a tradition for them to sign the walls. Uh, whoever come and stay here and play and that is just really cool if we had time to read all the names to you but you wouldn't want to watch that long of a video so Danny will just scan them it's just really cool but they said we're not allowed to sign it <laughs> we're not famous stony crown the courtroom was adjourned no verdict was returned and what let it read a book on this is the payphone that Buddy Holly used to call his wife on before he went on stage in 1959. And they've just closed it up. And if you haven't seen the Buddy Holly movie, we sat and watched it last night because we knew we were coming here and it was very interesting about his life and how he got to where he was at. And this will be the day that I die. This will be the day that I die. You ready to go? No, I'm waiting on my coat. I checked my coat. Isn't this cool? I guess you got a ticket and that way you didn't have to carry your coat around with you. I don't think they do things like this today. Maybe in some places, but none of the places we go, that's <laughs> for sure. Now at halftime there was we interrupt this program for a special news bulletin. Three young singers who soared to the heights of show business on the current rock and roll craze were killed today in the crash of a light plane in an Iowa snow flurry. The singers were identified as Richie Valens, 17, Buddy Holly, 22, and J.P. Richardson, known professionally as uh, the Big Bopper. The aircraft chartered from the Dwyer Flying Service crashed near Mason City, ironically the setting for the prominent musical The Music Man. The pilot, Roger Peterson of Clear Lake, Iowa, was also killed. The three singers had appeared at the Surf Ballroom in Clear Lake, Iowa last night and were on their way to Fargo, North Dakota. Their small chartered plane crashed in a lonely farmyard about 15 miles northwest of Mason City. Cause of the crash was due to inclement weather conditions. Details upcoming from Action Central News. Hey guys, if you've enjoyed this video, take a quick minute and hit that subscribe button. It really helps us out. Not only does it let YouTube know that you guys want us to keep producing videos, but it encourages us to keep it up. Until next time, God bless and many safe travels. And go RV America.